Welcome back to the Theme Park Wizard, and today we have another construction update. About time, it's been a long time, so sorry. Uh, between uh, construction updates from Mickey and Minnie's Runway Railway, you can thank the Mice Chat staff here, specifically Mike Kendrick, I think that's what it says. But here's the photos from the latest Mice Chat Disneyland update, which you can go check out the full Disneyland update. They do a whole bunch of Disney news and rumors. And things happening around the uh, Disneyland Resort on MyChat.com. They have an update every single Monday, and they they do absolutely fantastic work. But we have just a few pictures from Mickey and Minnie's Run Runaway Railway from this past weekend. I'll try to get to City Walk this weekend, and maybe downtown. I'll probably next time we'll be at Downtown Disney will be when Buena Vista Street opens, which will hopefully be this weekend or next weekend. But as you can see, work on the show building is really going very quickly here um this is the only cell phone shot so sorry about this the other photos will be um non-vertical but they you see they're pouring some more concrete or more cement on the site they topped out on the structure and they're getting ready to enclose the structure into its full warehouse form Again, this building is just a three, basically a three-story warehouse. So, yeah, about yeah, one, two, three, three-story, maybe a uh, additional fourth, smaller fourth story on the top. But just a massive warehouse, almost like an Amazon-type warehouse. So it's very easy to construct. Now, just as you saw with the Universal's uh, Super Nintendo World, they have a still up first, then you see the white stuff, and that white stuff is actually fireproofing it's like fire retardant fireproofing so it's, uh, it's required by california law to prevent fire from starting in the building so they have to put the fireproofing the fire retardant retardant on all the building on all the rest of the building looks like they bought maybe i'd say 25 percent of it so far doing the front part now throughout the rest of this week move on towards the ends of the building and the inside as well then they can start closing up the building and working on the indoor elements of the show building as well. Now I'm very curious about if construction will stop temporarily, like if they're like what they're doing with Tron, they're gonna just work on the exterior and then when they, when they finish the exterior, they're gonna take a pause until the next fiscal year. Kind of, they're gonna kind of spread out the costs by a few months. Now I wonder if Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway will do the same thing because they're working quite quickly on it, but the opening date got pushed back to 2023. So I wonder if they're just going to close up the building and then kind of take a construction pause to spread out some costs a little bit and then just work on it more slowly again like they've been doing. Um, but we, uh, I don't know if that's a rumor or not. That's just my kind of speculation based on what they're doing with Guardians of the Galaxy and Tron over at Walt Disney World. You know, closing up those buildings and kind of just stopping construction, pausing it over the next few months but not here so far in, in anaheim they're quickly quickly moving as there's construction workers all over you see three of them just in this cherry picker alone with those if someone can comment what are those things hanging from the ceiling i've seen those on other construction projects whether it's a rides or buildings i'm very curious what those are so please if you're uh if you're uh, construction into construction or your work construction please comment below what those um, things hanging from the ceiling um, are inside the show building right there but look how massive those floors are look those the workers look like look like look like like mini Lego figures compared to the the steel pieces there that are on those floors which is absolutely amazing i mean that building is massive when you see in person it is quite massive again it's slightly taller than i think rise of the resistance and millennium falcon in fact you can see in these pictures that um the roof line goes kind of above where the um the uh petrified trees would be so that's pretty cool but what do you guys think of this mini construction update and what do you guys think of making minis run away railway do you think it'll be pause maybe they'll pause construction after they close up the building or do you think they'll go full steam ahead and maybe open it earlier than 2023 
Let me know in the comments below. Give this video, video a big thumbs up if you liked it. And subscribe for more theme park updates. And as always, have a fantastic day.